Chicago State University. Nestled on Chicago's south side, CSU is home to almost 3,000 students. We are purpose-driven, diverse, and proven. Welcome to Chicago State University. CSU's library honors the late Gwendolyn Brooks, the first African-American to win the Pulitzer Prize for Poetry in 1950. She was a professor for over a decade here at CSU in the English department. The Gwendolyn Brooks Library features Rover, which is the first automated storage retrieval system installed in Illinois. The library contains over 425,000 volumes of books and more than 150 computers. There is also printing service for your convenience. Our occupational therapy, pharmacy, and CMAP programs are housed here in Douglas Hall. Fun fact about Chicago State University, we actually have a radio station which launched in 2012. It's called WCSU. On this radio station, you'll hear a variety of music from urban to K-pop. CSU gives current students and graduates the opportunity to host their own radio show. One of our recent graduates, Robert, hosts a K-pop radio show, The K-Way with Robert J. Many greats have attended CSU, including Chicago's very own Kanye West. His mother, Donda West, was an English professor here as well. Although he did not graduate, Kanye began recording some of his college dropout album in our Douglas Hall CMAT recording studio on the first floor of this building. Probably the coolest thing about this building is that it has a theater. Breaky Theater is well hidden and pretty big actually. You would never guess there is a theater in this building. The pharmacy program is located on the third floor of the Douglas Hall and was renovated and looks stunning. Our pharmacy program has several donors such as CVS, Walgreens, and is number one in the Midwest for graduating minorities. When you need a moment to relax or grab some grub, head over to the Student Union Building. It's the building with the glass cone. Here you will find a lot of our student resource centers You can also find the cafeteria in this building. Our Quasi Ronald Harris Rotunda holds a lot of our events, such as the Cinco de Mayo and Mr. and Miss CSU Coronation. Lastly, we have the quad area where many events are held, such as the Welcome Week, where many activities and resources are available for our students. The residence hall houses 330 students with co-ed, sweet style living. The residence hall has three lounge areas, a 24-hour computer lab with printing capability, and a laundry room. Don't worry about looking for quarters on wash day. The washers and dryers are coinless. CSU is dedicated to offering a safe community for our residents. The residence hall lobby is staffed 24 hours a day and is also under video surveillance to ensure the security of our students. One of our newer buildings on campus, the Emil and Patricia Jones Convocation Center, named after former Senate President Emil Jones Jr. and late wife Patricia, who is CSU alum, the Jones Convocation Center opened in 2007. It is home to our NCAA Division I men's and women's basketball teams and features a weight room, training room, and media room. The JCC sits 6,000 guests and it is the perfect venue for our commencement ceremonies and concert. Former President Barack Obama packed the house when he spoke on campus in 2014. Bernie Sanders also chose the JCC to host his 2016 campaign rally. The Jacoby Dickens Center is definitely a fun one to visit. In this building, you will find our gym, where we have state-of-the-art exercise equipment, including an indoor track and more. We hope you enjoyed this virtual tour of Chicago State University. We look forward to seeing you in the future. For more information on how you can become admitted to CSU, please feel free to contact us at the Undergraduate and Graduate Admissions offices.